Hi everyone and welcome back to Animal Crossing Fun Mode. Yay! It's time to jump back into our villager hunting. We have two more of our initial three to find. We did find Coco in the last part so I'm excited to jump on in and see who else we may come across today. But before we do that, let's take a moment to catch you up on what I got up to after the last part and then we'll jump on in. Let's go! So to start with, as soon as I got back from the island, this was waiting for me. So you bet I made sure to catch that bad boy and put it with our collection for Flick later. Next up, it was finally time to tackle this ridiculous mess that I'd left here. So I went through the arduous process of collecting it all up and putting it into storage and finally getting rid of it all. We did get quite a few bells though for all those extra things that we had collected on the island, so that was cool. After that it was time to donate exactly what we needed for the new shop so I made sure to hand over all the wood and the iron nuggets in order to get Nook's Cranny on its way. Of course this meant that we would need to find a good spot for him. And there we go, we are all set and tomorrow we will have our brand new Nook's Cranny. With that out of the way, the only other thing I really wanted to tackle while I had the time was to finally clear up all the weeds on the rest of the bottom area of the island. And there was a lot. <laughs> there was a lot of weeds, but after a little bit of time I did manage to get it all cleared up so it's looking nice and clean now. Before heading out, I managed to catch a really cool football fish, so that was great. We also managed to pay off our house loan with the excess bells that we had made, so we have a second upgrade now coming along. And I thought I'd take the chance now to change that roof, so we're going to go for a green roof this time. With that all done, the only thing left that I wanted to get accomplished was to decorate our beaches a little bit. They're looking very, very bare at the moment. So I took a little bit of time to run around and plant all of the coconuts that we've gathered off the Nook Mole Islands and yeah, hopefully in a couple of days it will look much nicer. And now that that's all done, it's time for us to jump into today's episode and go villager hunting. So let's go. What is with this rain? <laughs> It was raining all day on the last part and it looks like we're still getting more. I guess these April showers are still going on in March. <laughs> all right, so our museum is under construction today, which means that won't be open until tomorrow. That's okay. Anything else we need to know about, Tom? So sorry to inconvenience you all like this today. It's a shame to suspend your scientific endeavours. However, I hope having our splendid new museum completed by tomorrow will make up for this little setback <laughs> all right brilliant so blathers is working on getting our museum open which is great but we do have our shop open today nook's cranny is finally open oh that's great i'm really glad we finally got that open one more thing to celebrate the open of the shop we've added a new catalog service to nook shopping yeah we've already been working on getting that going so that's great Oh, here we go. <laughs> That's the sound of more duties calling. <laughs> One moment, please. Yes, yes, the getaway package. Why, yes, of course. I think that's our new villagers calling. So we're going to have a lot to do. But I definitely want to continue on and find our villagers first before I start crafting everything for the plots. <laughs> I don't want to risk them auto filling, so I feel a lot better if I have them all ready first and then I can focus on getting everything created for them and placing them down. I have no idea actually where I'm going to put them. I'm thinking I'll probably keep them where the starter homes are for Owl, Lyman and Ursula maybe and kind of use that area for now for all the villagers. I don't know, we'll have to have a look. All right, here we are. Let's see what's in the mailbox this morning. Daisy May, I'll be heading to your island every Sunday morning to sell my precious turnips the way my grandma used to. Ah, oh, that'd be great. I wonder if we'll make some money with that because I haven't done turnips for so long. We've got a present for upgrading our home again, which is great. I'll have a look at that in just a moment. Uh, apparently another gift as well. I have no idea what those are for. And we've got our reward from Gulliver. Let's see what that is. Let's just come out of that one second. So what did we get right here? 
So from the HHA, we got an old sewing machine. That'll probably be another good thing for Abel's later. An iron inset. And an elder mask. What's this? Oh. <laughs> okay then. Thanks, Gulliver, I think. <laughs> All right, let me go throw those away and then we can get cracking. All right, that's all in storage. So I haven't really been able to do much of our home, but as you can see, it's expanded again. So I need to move all this stuff back against the wall. I haven't got the bed yet. I thought we would get Luna's bed by now, or is it only when we upgrade again and get the back room? I don't know. Hmm, we'll soon find out. But yeah, it's looking very bare. Definitely needs some decorations and some love in here, but at least we got more storage because I was already filling it up. 69 out of 120. I did go through and delete a few of the items. Well, not delete them, but sell them. A few of the items that we don't actually need right now because we're just taking up unnecessary space. But what I'm going to do is grab some fresh Nook Mile tickets because we are going to need those. And let's head on out. One good thing is I did manage to get all of this mess cleared up and we made quite a lot of bells, as you saw, from doing that. That's what, able, that's what enabled me to pay off the house. So that was a really good thing. I'm glad we did that. I have yet to plant the fruit though. <laughs> I need to look at the map and kind of figure out a place to set up where we're going to have an orchard because that's going to be really handy both for money and for when we start getting crops and also gifts for the villagers as we get them. So I'm thinking that second area in the middle over the river, that sort of biggish area might work best for now. And it shouldn't, you know, hold me back with designing too much so it can be there for a little while. Um, yeah, just to the top left, top right of resident services across the river. Maybe there? I'm not sure. That's definitely something I need to look at later and figure out. That was the wrong one. I meant to actually click on this and see what points we've got. Ah, okay. So for upgrading our house, we're on level two with that one. Fantastic. All right, now... Let's go take a quick look. Oh yeah, I've still got all these wasps to sell. I could have sold these. Oh wait, is it Sunday today? It is Sunday today. Oh, Daisy May. Oh no, and I just paid off my house, so I don't really have any money for turnips right now. That's a shame. <laughs> it's probably a bit too soon to worry about turnips anyway, so I may worry about that next week. But for now, we'll just say hi. No thanks, we will talk to you a little bit more about it next weekend, but you have a wander around the island and enjoy yourself. And I'll come back for tissue for you at some point, because that looks nasty. <laughs> Alright, oh yeah, do you know what, I'm still so used to having the shop this side like we did in hard mode, and I forgot that this time I put it to the left rather than the right, just in case I do keep the villager homes this side. But we do have a bell spot, nice and convenient right here. So that's handy. Let me get another 10,000 bells in there. Let's put that away first. All right. And our other one should be probably ready tomorrow. Or no, it'll be the day after tomorrow, won't it? Yeah. All right. We'll go and put that down by the other one in just a moment. But let's go check out our new shop. Very nice. Oh, it looks cute. Let's go in and say hi. Oh, Mabel's here. I forgot she shows up on the first day. In just a short time, Blathers has moved in and we were able we were able to open up this shop. <laughs> I'm so pleased to hear that. Actually, I came here today to check in on you all and see if you need any assistance with anything. Yes, mysterious stranger, we're going to pretend we don't know your name. We we really need some clothes. <laughs> Especially because in this playthrough, we can actually wear them and enjoy them. <laughs> Something come to mind? Well, we still have some logistical challenges to overcome. It depends on mail orders for a lot of our goods. Having this shop should make it a bit easier for us to obtain ready-made furniture and stuff like that. But we still need a clothing supplier. Mabel, can you help us out with that? As it turns out, it's really not that difficult for us to get to this island. Brilliant. So hopefully soon she may come and visit and then we may be able to get her shop. I hope so. 
I really need I really need some fun clothes because my designing is not on par at the moment and I'm well out of practice as well. <laughs> I probably should upgrade that app soon so I can actually start experimenting again with that, but you know, it's not it's not a big rush. We can get to that. Thanks to your help, we've opened this amazing new shop. New shop. <laughs> oh, welcome to Nook's Cranny. Yay. I'm so glad we finally have a shop. Didn't take long at all. All right. Well, unfortunately, there's nothing here that's actually exciting me right now, but we are going to take a quick look in the cabinet. What do you have today? Let's. Oh, I like this parasol. That'll be perfect for Pico when eventually we get her. Actually, I may buy that. Maybe that'll give us kind of a good... Mm, maybe a good little omen to actually attract her on our villager hunt today. <laughs> All right, what else have we got? Um, hmm. I will need some wrapping paper soon, but I'm not going to worry about gifts just yet until we've got a few more villagers. Do we need any more DIYs or anything yet? I don't think so. I think we've got... This one we haven't got yet, so we'll get that one. Yeah, that will do. That will give us a few more recipes. And I think that's all we really need for now. I should probably have a look if I have got a nice wallpaper or something because our house is very, very bare. Even more recipes. Perfect. All right. So have you got anything? Oh, no. No. And this I've already got. <laughs> it comes with the house. So, yeah, none of that. All right. Well, another time, maybe. Thank you. Thank you. Let's head on out. all right <laughs> as you can see i've got a little bit of a collection starting up again for blabbers when the museum opens tomorrow especially our new football fish and that tarantula that tried to jump scare me when i got back to the island <laughs> so they're waiting for blathers now all i really need to do is get our daily points and i'm guessing tom nook's gonna gonna want to collar us to help with those plots today and the bridge so let's speak to him first your home is much roomier, yes? Yeah, it's definitely going to serve us well for a while. But we can't pay that off just yet. Maybe soon. <laughs> Hold the phone. Someone's calling. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have a feeling we're going to get a longer to-do list today. <laughs> no trouble at all. I just need to draw up the proper contracts. Understood. We will get back to you. Mm. Sorry to keep you waiting. I suppose you overheard that call. For some time now, I've been advertising the Elysian getaway package. And wouldn't you know, out of the blue, we have three interested parties. Well, actually, Tom, you probably only have one because I've only come across one so far. But <laughs> that's great. Wonderful, except for one minor little detail. None of our applicants are too fond of the notion of sleeping in tents, you see. Why? The tents are pretty cute and it kind of adds to the experience, don't you think? So we're going to need three homes, setting aside the land, preparing all the furnishings. Yeah, I'm guessing you're going to want me to help you with that, aren't you? <laughs> I know, I have a wonderful idea. <laughs> Would you help me get these homes all prepared? Of course we will. We're excited to help you. Thank you so much. I'll never forget this. You're going to need some top secret instructions. So when you're ready, come and talk to me and ask me what should I do? All right. Well, we may as well ask you what we need to do while we're right here. And I think we'll do the ceremony later for Nook's Cranny. So we need to start with building a bridge. And this time I've got two rivers to choose from, so I have no idea which side's going to be better to have it on at the moment. Unless I put it where I plan to do the orchard and farming kind of area for now, because that might be more convenient. I don't know, we'll have to, we'll have to check on that a bit later. If our villager hunt doesn't take too long this time, we may get a little bit more than that done in this part. Otherwise, that might be something I have to do off camera or before the next part. We will see. Let's have a look. So we've got our daily miles. Is there anything we might want today? Let's see. Um, hmm. KK Reggae, huh? We'll definitely have some of that. <laughs> Especially now we can actually play some of the music. Other than that, I don't think there's anything else we need right now. I will quickly check the Nook 
a mile redemption just in case there's anything there that we might want i need all of this stuff i really do but we haven't got any have we not got any diys or anything yet no oh no you get that when the resident services upgrades i think don't you that's fine so yeah there's nothing we really need desperately right now which means we can head straight on out for our villager hunt brilliant i'm gonna worry about the dailies and stuff like that later that i need to get done like going around hitting my rocks although i'm not really fussed about it to be honest with you i'm a lot more relaxed in this one because i gathered up so much from those islands that i think i'm kind of set with materials for a little bit do i need to empty anything out of my inventory oh actually yes i need to get rid of our money tree and pop that down over here let's just make a little spot behind this one at least they'll be easy to see when they're grown. And I think I'll pop the parasol down right here because I don't need it right now. Might be worth keeping it on me just in case <laughs> it helped with finding Pico somehow. All right, so let's pop that away. Oh, hi Ursula, what do you need? Anyone tell you about reactions yet? Oh, brilliant, she's going to teach us reactions. I was wondering when we might get those. Thank you so much. I learned a reaction. I think she gave us a few, didn't she? Yeah, so we got joy, greetings, delight and surprise. Okay, um, I'll worry about those later and we'll rearrange them. But at least we've got some points for that as well. Thank you, Ursula. That's another 300 for us. Fantastic. Right, so before we head out on the villager hunt, uh, just a quick note, I don't know what was going on with me in the last part, but for some reason I kept referring to uh, ketchup as pep um, as normal, and I don't know why. I'm very aware that she is a peppy, but I even had her as <laughs> normal on my little graphic here. So I don't know why, but I've actually corrected that thanks to a lovely comment that pointed it out to me. And I've corrected it on here, and obviously, yeah, I know she's peppy. I don't know why I was referring to her as normal. I don't know, I think I just got distracted by the fact that we had so many. But as you can see, we have got one of our potential villagers ticked off. So these are who we're going to be looking for today. We're only going to be able to find peppy or lazy. So ideally, we've only got four that we're looking for, unless we consider the wild cards. So yeah, these are the top four that I'm kind of hoping to come across. Eric, Stitches, Aldi or Ketchup. But, you know, if I come across Shino again, I'm going to be honest, I don't think I can say no to her twice. The more I thought about it after the last part, the more I thought I kind of wish I would have brought her now. But I'm really glad we did get Coco. So I don't know, we'll have to see who we come across, but... Yeah, I'm excited. I hope this doesn't take too long though to find because I'd really love to find both today if we could. But let's get started and head on out to our first island. We want to fly. We are very ready. Help us find another good villager for our island. And maybe even some more gold. <laughs> because <laughs> that would definitely be handy as well but let's head on out and go check out the first island ah oh, straight away we've got sister fruit island that's great we definitely need some money because i'm kind of broke now i've only got ten thousand. there's nothing in the adb because i paid off the house but let's have a look about and see who we've got uh who is that oh is that um tammy isn't it yeah tammy with the really cool eyeliner <laughs> hi tammy nice to see you but definitely not who we're looking for but hopefully with the fact that we can only come across peppy and lazy today it will make our lives a little bit easier so what i'm going to do is i'm going to run around as usual and grab the fruits and things and then we will head on to the next island all right so here we are on island number two let's see who's waiting for us right here oh, please be someone good let's see all right no one on this side by the looks of it is there a diy before i go around the other side no okay so they may be on the beach oh <laughs> i knew he didn't see you then hi pippi 
Oh, you're very cute, but no, not not the Peppy I'm looking for. I'm afraid. Oh, there is a DIY on this one though. What do we get? Anything good? Let's see. Ah, uh, from Roswell, we got a wooden bucket. We're probably already going to know that, aren't we? No. I guess that's one of the ones that Tom Nook gives us, but never mind. <laughs> Thanks anyway, I guess. All right, short and sweet visit to this one. Let's head on back and check out island number three instead and hope for someone good. We're ready to head home. We sure are. Oh, look, Pippi's actually trying to come and get on the plane too. I'm sorry, Pippi. No, no, Pippi. No, I'm sorry. Don't look at me like that. No. I, but quick, Wilbur. Quick, get me out of here. <laughs> she really wants to... Oh, okay. No. <laughs> oh, no. I feel bad now. <laughs> I feel bad now. Poor little Pippi. She was literally trying to follow us to the plane. That's cute. All right. We're on island number three, aren't we? Yeah. I, I think I can count this time. Oh, Bo! Oh, as you can remember, Bo was actually on the mood board originally, but because of Eric, I decided we wouldn't go for Bo as well. But Bo is so cute. Oh, Bo. Oh, now I'm going to struggle again, aren't I? Because I do really like Bo. But I've already got more than what, what I can have, and I really think I want Eric over Bo, but... If I, if I had enough spaces to have both, I would, but then I would have to cut out someone else that I really want. Oh, no. All right. I'm going to just debate this momentarily why I try and get a wasp. But I, I, I think I'm... Oh, we've got another DIYs. And the last time we struggled to find any out of like, what, 20 islands, 21 islands. And this time we're finding them pretty easily, which is nice. But yeah, I think I think I'm kind of set with the ones that I have in mind now to be honest with you. So as much as I'd love to have Bo, I think I'll save him for the next island. Yeah, cuz I really think I, I want Eric for this particular idea that I have. That's that's what I think will be a better fit for my ideas maybe. Yeah. But it's hard because he is so cute and he's definitely a really good villager that I like. There's our wasp. Lovely. All right. So we are all set. What item did we get? I was too busy waffling. I didn't even realize. A humidifier. Okay. <laughs> all right. Oh, Bo. Look how adorable you are. Seriously. Oh no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I really am hoping to find stitches or Eric. Another time. Another time for sure. Sorry, Bo. Oh. Oh, this is so much harder than I thought it was gonna be. So much harder. But let's head on back and check out island number four. We are ready. Begrudgingly, but we're ready. All right, we're on island number four. I totally didn't have to check. <laughs> oh, is that Aussie? I think it's Aussie. Aussie is another cute one, if I'm right. Yeah, look at that face. Oh my God. Nintendo make this hard for us. There's just too many good villagers. Oh, I don't think I have the Orchid Mantis yet. So let me just, Aussie. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> he's too cute. Come on. Ah, oh. you're definitely one I would like to have another time for sure, but not not today. Sorry, Ozzy. But hopefully we can just grab our wasp and that before we head on back. Let's have a quick check so we can find a good item here as well. I definitely. Uh, I'm definitely wanting to do a second island real soon, I will say. Oh, book stands. That's quite a good one. Let's have a look if we've got a DIY. The problem with me is I have so many ideas 
Oh my god, we've got another one. Wow, that's four for four right now, I think. Oh no, we didn't have one on the first one, but we've had one on all three since. That's good. And we've got a scarecrow. Oh, brilliant. That'll be great for our farming area. But yeah, I mean, the problem for me is that I have so many ideas that I want to do. <laughs> <laughs> so so many i need i need to do all the things i really do oh i didn't find the wasp yet so let me do that real quick we've only got a couple more trees oh actually just this one hopefully it's this one no all right well that means it's going to be up the top so i can't get that right now that's fine did i shake the ones up there i think so anyway <laughs> let's see what points we got was that for the shaking of the trees maybe yeah, shaky shade, shady shake down, <laughs> shaky shaky. Apparently, all right, lovely. We got two thousand for that. So let's head on back and check out island number five. Hopefully, I mean we're finding so many cuties already. Again, we are having amazing luck, I will say, but not quite the ones we're looking for just yet. So let's try another one. All right, island number five. This is going really well so far, even though we haven't come across who we're looking for just yet. We are seeing some really cute ones. Who have we got over here? Oh, come on, Egbert. We saw you on the last hunt. <laughs> I mean, it's not really a duplicate. We haven't seen them just yet, but we've already come across you. Hi, Egbert. You still haven't got any sleep, I see. <laughs> oh no definitely a no for me sorry Egbert all right have we got a DIY on this one maybe let me have a quick little saw around hopefully there's another one on here okay no not on this one all right well I'll have a quick look for the wasps and then we'll head on over to the next island Island number six, here we are. It is island number six, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> All right, who? Oh, come on. Egbert and now Al again. Oh no, Al. You are a waste of a ticket, I'm afraid. <laughs> oh. I'm so glad I didn't grind for these miles because I would be super annoyed right now, but no, <laughs> it's all right. All right, any DIY to kind of make up for that? <laughs> oh, I have a feeling this... Oh, actually, yeah, we do. Perfect. I have a feeling this is actually probably going to take a while, though. Especially because we've got less that we're looking for in this kind of area. Is that the same one we just got? Or did, was it the mini table? I don't remember, but we can leave that right here for someone else. Maybe Al can make it while he's hanging out on this island. All right, I'm going to find the wasp and the item, and then we will head on to island number seven. Island number seven. Is it going to be lucky number seven? Lucky number seven? All right, okay. Uh, is this game messing with me? We are literally now coming across all the villagers that we came on, across on the last one. Al, Egbert, and now Drake. Drake, you're cute, but no. <laughs> no, Drake, I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, come on. At least show me some new villagers, please. I don't think I'm even going to bother with a wasp. <laughs> oh, no. Who am I kidding? I need the money. I do need the money and I need the item, actually, as well. And hopefully, at least a DIY, maybe. Nothing on this side. We'll have a check on the other side can't believe that's i mean i guess it's kind of to be expected considering you can only come across the lasers and so on but ooh, imperial load table and we've got the paper lantern on the last one so that's good but yeah i do i guess it is kind of expected because we can only come across lasers and peppies now for this for this trip but still there is a lot more <laughs> than just those three that were already coming across twice oh no i'm not in the right oh <laughs> Oh, that is the first time I've got myself stung. Except when it was needed for the miles. But oh no, I was at the wrong angle for that. This is what happens when you waffle. You don't pay attention to what you're doing. <laughs> um, hmm. All right, let's make let's make the medicine real quick. I didn't bring any with me because I got a bit cocky thinking I wouldn't need it. 
<laughs> is it five? I think it's five weeds, isn't it? It's either three or five, let's see. I need to fix my face before we go to island number eight or I'm going to scare away any potential villagers. Uh, right, let's do... Oh, it, oh, it was only three. Okay. Brilliant. There we go. Let's make you all better. And then I will drop these because I don't need to take these with me and I don't want to stop off and have to empty out just yet. No, 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 no. There we go. All good. All right, let's head on to... Wait. Oh, it's happening again, isn't it? Yeah, it will be island number eight, won't it? No, I'm okay. I think I'm okay. <laughs> oh, no. Apparently, when I'm tired, I, I forget how to do basic math and count. And I doubt myself. But yeah, I think, I think we're on track today, at least. All right, here we are on island number eight. Really? Really? I'm just going to sulk straight off this island because that is yet another one that we've already come across on the last hunt. And out of all the peppies and all the lazies that we could be finding, we're seeing the same ones. <laughs> take me home. Please, just, just take me home. <laughs> Oh no, this is going to take a while, isn't it, Wilbur? I have a feeling this is really going to take a while. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, island number nine. <laughs> oh, let's see. Hopefully someone new. Just give me someone new, even if it's not one we're looking for. Oh, Boomer. I don't think we come across Boomer before, did we? Boomer's cute. At least you're someone new, I think. Hi, Boomer. I definitely want you on one of my islands one day. But not, not this particular one, I'm afraid. Another time. All right, let me go find our wasp. And also, hopefully, a DIY, maybe. Oh, yeah. All right, what do we get? Something good? From Bella. It is a birdhouse. And again, another one that Tom Nook gave us. So we can just leave that right here. Okay, we're on island number 10. It looks like we've got a bamboo island. I did grab a lot of bamboo before, so I don't think we really need any right now. But I may get a few more shoots while I'm here. Let's see. Who have we got? Oh, <laughs> come on. All right, so another duplicate technically but i can't be too mad i mean it's cherry or sheree i don't know the right way to say it but she's a cutie so i can't be mad at that but no i'm sorry not not the one i'm looking for i'm afraid all right have we got any diy on this island i think i might hold off on the shoots for now i don't know do i do i need them it probably would be worth getting them having because i've got 10 of each of the fruit trees so having 10 bamboo especially while we're in bamboo season, would probably be helpful. Yeah, let me grab all the shoots. There's only five to get, and then I will see you back at the airport. All right, so I've emptied out our inventory and grabbed a fresh stack of tickets. So let's see if this next 10 will bring us a little bit more luck. I think we've gone through the duplicates now. I'm hoping, <laughs> I'm hoping we don't come across any of the same ones again, and hopefully come across the ones we're actually looking for which would be really really nice so let's see we're gonna start this is gonna be we're gonna be on number 11 aren't we yeah so let's use our first one of this new stack and see who we find looks like again our first one of this stack is sister fruit island so that's good definitely gonna get some more bells here which is gonna be super helpful because we are very very broke right now just 10,000 to our name. All right. More importantly, who... Oh, who are you? Annabelle. I don't think I've come across Annabelle before. I know of her, but look at her, look at her cute little paws and ears with the purple. That's really sweet. Never noticed that on her before. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Annabelle. At least you're someone new. <laughs> no, not, not who we're looking for, I'm afraid. 
No DIY. Okay, I'm going to grab all the fruit ready to sell back on our island and I will meet you on island number 12. Here we are on island number 12. Fingers crossed, everyone. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Who have we got? Let's see. Oh, <laughs> it's Dr. COVID. <laughs> Is it... um? Raddle, I want to say. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how many people had him on their island during COVID. That would have been funny. Oh, sorry, Raddle. Definitely not for me, but very cool to see you. <laughs> All right. Once again, I'm going to grab anything we need from this island, which is just the wasp and the item at the moment. Uh, I don't really need anything else. And then we'll head on and check out Lucky number 13, I reckon. Yeah, it's got to be lucky number 13. I'll see you in just a moment. All right, lucky number 13, maybe? Let's see. Oh, it's Clay. <laughs> I think we saw Clay before, possibly. I don't know. Maybe. I don't remember. Oh, no, it was um Soleil, I think. Possible. Oh, I don't even remember at this point, but no. Sorry, Clay, not for us. He's so unusual, though, isn't he? He's definitely one of the very unique designs. Probably an acquired taste, I'm going to guess. But no, not, not one that I've ever wanted, to be honest. So it's not a debate on this one. Um, hmm. Do we have a DIY? No. All right, so then I will grab the wasp and the item from this island and I will see you on lucky 14, <laughs> maybe. We'll find out. Okay, so one of these have got to be lucky. <laughs> Let's see if it's lucky number 14. Are we going to find someone good? Let's see. Benedict. Hmm. Is it Benedict? Oh, we did have Benedict before, didn't we? We had Egbert and Benedict. So yeah, another another duplicate, I think. Hi, Benedict. Oh, no. No, definitely not. I'm sorry. Definitely not. All right, not quite there yet. I wonder how many tickets it's going to take before we come across one of the ones we're looking for. Mm. Maybe we'll get to lucky number 20, 20 again. Or was it 21, wasn't it, with Coco? Yeah, because of the free one. So it might be lucky number 21 again. We'll see. <laughs> Hopefully not. I'd love it if we could find her much sooner. And we're, we're looking and hoping for either Audi or ketchup out of the peppies, ideally. Or peanut. Peanut's another one that I, I would be happy to come across. And then, obviously, Stitches and Eric are the lasers that we're kind of hoping to come across. A cacao tree. On the last one, we got a... Um, what did we get? Was it a, a ko kotatsu? I don't know how to pronounce that. And I, I don't want to butcher the beautiful language of Japanese, I believe it is. But, yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's head on back and try island number 15 and see how we get on there. We are ready. Let's fly. Okay, island number 15, and we have a bamboo island. By the way, happy Easter, guys. I hope you're all having a lovely Easter Sunday, wherever you are, whether you celebrate it or not. Happy Easter. And have some chocolate for me. <laughs> oh, it's Sprinkle. Hi, Sprinkle. She was on the mood board for winter. Yeah, I don't know if I actually put her on the actual mood. Uh, no, we didn't actually put her on the mood board. She was in the initial brainstorming, though. But because we've got so many lined up for winter, I didn't actually keep her on there. Oh, but she is very cute. I do like Sprinkle. But unfortunately not. Sorry, Sprinkle. Not today. All right, do we have a DIY maybe on this island? I think I'm all set with the bamboo for now, so I'm not going to worry about that. No, no DIY. That's fine. Let's head on back and try island number 16 then and see how we get on there. At least we're seeing some new ones. That's good. <laughs> yeah, we are all ready. Let's head on back. Island number 16, I want to say. 
I believe it's 16. Yeah. All right. Who have we got on island number 16 waiting for us? Uh, I don't actually remember your name. Oh, wait. Is it um Jeremiah? Maybe. Oh, check me out. <laughs> All right. Hi, Jeremiah. No, I'm sorry. Not not for me but nice to see you and all <laughs> all right let's see have we got any diy or anything over here i'll have to check the beaches in a moment but first things first there should be a nice wasp hopefully for me that won't mess up my face again and hopefully a good item right there's our wasp nailed it <laughs> all right Brilliant. So we got that. Let's see. Have we got an item close by? Probably not. Probably the last tree, won't it? All right. Let me check. Any DIY? Any DIY? Nope. Not on this side. All right. Oh, well, there's our item. Okay. Garden faucet. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right. Have we got a DIY on this side, potentially? No. All right, so let's head on back. We've got a couple more islands left. So let's try island number 17. Number 17. Here we go. <laughs> oh, I don't actually remember this one's name, to be honest. Uh, no, I can't think of his name. Nate. Hi, Nate. I don't think I've come across you yet, or not for a very long time if I have. Those are some very funky green eyebrows you got going on there. <laughs> that is kind of cute. Not, not who we're looking for though, so we'll definitely be moving on to island number 18 in just a moment. Well, let's see if I can find a quick item here before we go. Oh, I'm so anxious. I can't wait to see who we do end up finding. It was very climactic last time, right on the last ticket. And I have a feeling it might end up going a very similar way this time. But we've only got a couple left in this stack. I think after this one, we've only got, yeah, three more. And then we'll be up to 20 again. And then we might have to actually speed it along a little bit. Who knows? Depends on how lucky we actually get today. But it doesn't seem like we're getting any more DIYs. I wonder if there's some kind of cap on it. Who knows? All right, here's our item. And we've got another ironing board. I feel like the game is telling me to clean. I'm getting all the ironing and ironing sets and ironing boards. <laughs> all right, okay. Well, let's head on out and check out the next island. Uh, it's going to be 18 now, isn't it? Yeah. Wow, that feels like it's gone pretty quick, to be honest. But yeah, let's go and see what Island 18 holds. Number 18. All right. All right, who have we got? Let's find out. <laughs> oh, it's Bangle again. Oh, Bangle, we did see you on the last hunt, didn't we, pretty early on? Hi, Bangle. I do still really like you, but no, not, not the peppy I'm looking for, I'm afraid. All right, well, hopefully the last two might, might be a bit luckier for us, I'm hoping. Still no DIY on this one so far. I don't think we've got, I don't think we're going to get any more for a while, maybe. We started off pretty well with the DIYs. Okay, so what have we got here? Oh, a papa bear. Okay. And what about the wasp? Anywhere around here? Yeah, there we go. At least we're going to have a nice stockpile for when Flick does come. That will give us some really good money. Got quite a few lined up ready for him. All right, quick check of this beach. Oh, wow, we did actually get a DIY. Perfect. Please be something that I don't already have from Tom Nook. <laughs> All right, large cardboard boxes. Uh, not not the best, but you know, it's something. What have we got? Um, let me just have a look. Yeah, not a great one, not a great one, but you know, something new, something new at least. Okay, so let's go try island number 19. We are almost at the end of our second stack. Wow. 
I wonder how many it's actually going to take us this time. Could be a lot more than last time, who knows? But let's fly back and go to island number 19. Alright, let's see who's waiting for us on this one. Come on, give us someone good. Uh, oh, is that um, oh, Hopkins? Yeah, I think so. Oh, Hopkins is a cutie. He really is. Oh, this, you're all making this hard for me now again. But no, I'm sorry, Hopkins. I've got my heart set on two other lasers at the moment. Maybe another time, though, for sure, because you are super, super cute. I bet, I bet Hopkins is quite popular. Oh, oh, we've got another one. Wow, okay. I thought we was probably not going to get find anymore for a while. What do we get? A rocking horse. Very nice. That's cute. That's a cute DIY. All right, guys, I'm going to grab the wasp and the item, and then I will see you on the final island for this stack, which is number 20. Let's see if it goes like it did last time, or if we're going to have to carry on for a bit longer. All right, island number 20. Yeah. Okay, so now we're two stacks in, and no. Is that Wendy? I think it's Wendy, isn't it? Wendy, maybe, or Eunice? Wendy, yeah. <laughs> Very cute colours, Wendy, but no. Well, it looks like we're definitely going to have to go a little bit more. Maybe we'll get lucky on number 21 like we did with Coco, but who knows? I'm going to have to grab what we need from this island, which is now just an item. And I guess we're going to have to get some more Nook Mile tickets and see, see if we can find someone because... Yeah, it's not really going our way just yet, but you know, we have time. We have time. I was hoping we might find the last two in this one part, but it doesn't seem to be the case unless we, you know, have a couple of hours. <laughs> so what I'll do, oh, perfect, lovely. A digital alarm clock, All right? Uh, okay, no DIY, on oh, wow, okay. <laughs> I was actually just assuming that we wasn't going to get another DIY, so yeah, we'll swap it. Oh, what am I going to swap it with? Uh, hmm, I don't know what I want to... Let's get rid of the ironing board. Yeah, okay, what did we get for the DIY? Modelling clay. Okay, and I think I've had that one for a very long time. Brilliant. I don't know why I worried too much about what to drop, because I forgot I can just take it with me. All right, so I guess we better empty out our pockets, grab some more tickets and continue on. We're not quite there yet, but hopefully very soon we'll find our next villager. I really hope so. Let's see. All right, we have a fresh stack of tickets. We're on Island 21, which was quite lucky for us last time. I wonder how it's going to work out this time. Let's see. Hmm. Maybe. <laughs> or not. Or we're just going to get another duplicate. <laughs> oh, Tammy. Tammy, not the one. Definitely not the one. All right, well, we'll continue on and see how we do. Hopefully, we're going to find who we're looking for pretty soon, I hope. 22. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, Philbert. Philbert, you cutie. Oh, I do love Philbert. Oh, you're definitely going to be on another island for sure, but... Oh, come on, you're so cute. So cute. But no, not not the one I'm hoping to find. I'm not quite ready to give up just yet, but we might have to start speeding through these islands if we don't have much luck or this video is going to go on for hours. <laughs> so let me grab what we need and I will see you on 23. We got it. Oh, oh. All right, well, at least I've got the wasp. I just need the item. So let's grab that and then we can make our way to island number 23. 
What do we got? Folding floor lamp. Nothing exciting, but we didn't check actually if there's a DIY. Oh, there is. Brilliant. What do we get on this one? From Flip. Oh, brilliant. I love this DIY. And I oh, never find it easy. But I really want this for, uh, especially if we get maple, because I want to do like the honey farm, which I don't know why, but I just think will be really cute. So I'm really happy we got that. All right. Well, not a total foul. We've got Philbert and a cute DIY, but let's head on to the next island and see who we come across. Let's go. Number 23. Let's see. <laughs> oh no. No, 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 no. Definitely not. I think, is this Raw Ray? Or Elvis? Oh, Rex, not even close. <laughs> not doing too great on the names right now, but no. Sorry, Rex. Oh, I forgot my net broke. Ah. You know what? I kind of want to speed this along, so I think I'm going to give, as, as much as I don't want to lose the bells, I think I'm just going to skip the items for a while and the wasps and not worry about them too much because we have a villager to find and no time to waste. So yeah, let's head on back and go straight to 24. Okie dokie, number 24. I'm starting to feel a bit like a bingo caller here. <laughs> All right, who have we got? Ah, uh, oh, it's Hornsby. Hornsby is one of the rhinos that I do really, really like. He definitely is a cutie. But no, I'm sorry, Hornsby. Not who we're looking for. And I don't know. Oh, I don't know how long it's going to take. I really hope we come across them soon. Come on. Oh, at least we've got a DIY, though. What do we get? Oh, it was from Stitches as well. I just saw it as I opened it quickly cardboard bed maybe that's a good sign maybe that means we're going to come across stitches real soon i will totally freak out if we do because i absolutely love stitches i really love him and i hope we i hope we do find him he'll be a great one to find very quickly all right well i guess it's onwards to number 25 let's head back number 25 okay who are we gonna have oh <laughs> it's big top <laughs> Oh, you are a funny one. Hi, Big Top. <laughs> no, no, definitely not. I'm sorry, definitely not. All right. Let's try our luck for it, DIY at least, while we're here. Anything? No, I don't think so. No. Okay, onwards and upwards. We'll get there. I'm very, very sure we're going to get there. It's not going so well so far, but yeah. <laughs> Can you tell that I'm kind of losing hope at the moment? I am have a feeling this might take hundreds, but we'll see. Let's head on to island number 26. Let's see if 26 is going to be the one. <laughs> I'm not losing the will to live just yet, but I'm getting close. Ah, oh, I oh, forget your name. Um... Pinky, maybe? Tutu. <laughs> that wasn't even close. Oh, Tutu. I don't know where I got Pinky from. I have no clue where I got that from, but... <laughs> no, sorry, Tutu. Definitely not for us. All right. Any DIY? <laughs> Pinky. God knows what I was thinking there. Is there a villager called Pinky? I may have to Google it. I don't think so. I just for some reason that's what I thought of all right island number 27 here we come 27 here we go <laughs> it's is it park yeah oh park you're cute oh brr. <laughs> no I'm sorry park definitely not coming with us today but I'm going to see if we got a DIY before we race on to number 28. Oh no, I have a feeling I'm going to have to start speeding through these islands. We are not having much luck right now. And considering we've only got Lazy and Peppy, I would have thought we would have come across them by now, you know. 
All right, well, let's see. Island 28, let's head on over there. 28, here we go. Oh, who are you? Who? Oh, Ruby, of course. Can't believe I forgot your name, Ruby. Oh, Ruby's cute. I don't think I've seen her, you know, for a very long time on a villager hunt. Oh, you are definitely cute. You are definitely cute, but just not who I'm looking for, I'm afraid. So let me see. Any DIY? I'm getting quicker and quicker here now because I'm like, oh, this video is going to go on forever. I may have to start, you know, speeding through all the islands and just hoping that we come across one very, very soon. It's not looking good, guys. Not looking good. All right, island number 29. Wow, I can't believe we're almost at 30 tickets. How do people do this for hours and hours with hundreds of tickets? Oh, my God. And it's Bangal again. Oh. <laughs> Bangal, you're getting less and less cute the more I see you. Come on. <laughs> All right, we're off to island number 30 right away because we have no time to waste now. Let's go straight to island 30 and hope for the best. <laughs> oh, I'm losing the will to live, guys, already. Okay, so we're at the end of our third stack of tickets now. Island number 30. What do we think? Do we have a good feeling about number 30? Oh, well, I see a DIY right away. That's good to know. <gasps> I don't know if I checked the last island. I didn't, did I? Oh, I see her. Patty! No, Patty. Come on now. This is three or four times that we've seen you. <laughs> Including the last villager hunt, I mean. All right, let's get our DIY. What did we get? From Jambet. A nice branch. Is that... Oh, God. That is probably the worst DIY ever. Let me see. Is that the twig thing? Yeah. All right. Well, why would it take three branches to make one? That's what I want to know. Why would it take three just to make a single branch? I don't know. All right. I guess we better head back and get some more tickets. We're not quite done yet, but we're probably going to have to start going through this a bit quicker, I reckon. Yeah. All right. Let's head on back. All right, we are at ticket number 31. We have Sister Fruit Island again, which is great. But we're going to start speeding through these islands, I think, and seeing how long it's going to take for us to finally get lucky. Thirty-eight. <gasps> oh my god! Thirty-eight. Lucky thirty-eight. And we found Aldi. Oh my god. I was starting to think we were never going to find one of them. Hi Aldi. Oh look how pretty you are. Look how pretty she is. Is she not perfect for our summer section? Is she not absolutely perfect for our summer section? Oh, I'm so excited. So we found Aldi. Oh, Aldi, you are coming to Elysian. No doubt about it. Oh, I'm so, I'm so glad. <laughs> Nearly 40 tickets, but we found one. Come to live on my island. Oh my gosh, this is more exciting than a fifth cup of coffee. See what I mean? We are just meant to be besties. She's a coffee girl, just like me. 
<laughs> All right, finally. I'm five different flavors of excited about moving to Elysian. Me too. There we have it, guys. It took a while, but we fight. Oh my God, look at the clock. One, one, one. What is it with the synchronistic numbers we keep having? But yeah, this is exciting. So it took a while, but we got Audi. So that is two out of three that we've found now. So hopefully in the next part, we will find villager number three and we can get our plots down. And yeah, we've got a lot, a lot of exciting things coming up. I can't wait. But thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.